Hello, Jerome here, and welcome to this video on analysis tips. Now, today I'll be sharing with you on a good way to map out an equidistant channel, or better known as an ED channel. Now, what we have here in screen is a pound dollar chart on the H4 time frame. To draw an equidistant channel or ED channel, we will need to use the tool provided by MT4. Alright, now I always describe this icon as looking like a hot dog with mustard on top and the letter E on the side. So what we're going to do, we're just going to click on this icon, this ED channel. Now the way to use this tool properly is to click on the tool, select one high on the chart, while holding down your mouse button, click and drag your tool to the next high on the chart. All the while holding down the mouse button. Now, what you're going to do then is to double click on this ED channel so that the modification boxes appear. Now click and move the bottom band of the ED channel so that it touches one of the low points on the chart. And there you have it. You've just drawn an ED channel using the ED channel tool provided by the MT4 platform. Now I'm going to explain a bit more on the modification boxes so you can adjust the ED channel. The two ends of this uh, ED channel controls the tilt or the pivot. While the bottom band controls the width of this ED channel. And the center modification box basically allows you to move the entire ED channel around. Now there is no hard and fast rule on drawing an ED channel, but aim for the best visual fit so that you can have as many points as possible touching the inside of this channel. Now you basically use the ED channel for prediction. In this case, what we expect is for price to possibly touch the top band of this channel before moving down towards the bottom band. Now another way to use the ED channel is for trend identification. Now to do this, we're going to change to the Euro Dollar chart on the daily time frame. Now we're just going to apply what we just learned by drawing an ED channel. Just click on the ED channel tool, select one high on the chart, and drag your mouse all the way to the next high. Double click on the ED channel tool so that the modification boxes are out and drag the bottom band of the ED channel to fit to a low. Right? Try and adjust so that you have as many points touching this ED channel as possible. Now that you've drawn the channel, we can see that Euro is still moving within this downward ED channel. Thus, we can say that Euro Dollar is still obeying an overall downward trend. Okay, that's it. And thank you for watching. This is Jerome signing off. Upon your mind, my condola, lick a pay, book a new bow, bow. I be pocky, pocky, law, we can boo, boo, ha, lick a, 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 lick a